Did you know before you appointed him that he had that record and was so critical of Robert Mueller? I did not know that. I did not know he took views on the Mueller investigation as such. And when you found that out? I don't think it had any effect. If you look at those statements, those statements, that can, they really can be viewed either way. But I don't think it would well, have any impact. Well, he says there's no collusion. Chris, he says, the, he says well, we can, you can starve I mean, the investigation. Right. What do you do when a person's right? There is no collusion. He happened to be right. I mean, he said it. So if he said there is collusion, I'm supposed to be taking somebody that says there is, because then I wouldn't take him for two reasons. But the number one reason is the fact that he would have been wrong. If he said that there's no collusion, he's right. He is going to have to make, or could potentially make, a lot of big calls in the Mueller investigation. If Mueller decides that he wants to subpoena you, the Attorney General, Whitaker, can block that. If Mueller issues a final report, he can decide how much goes to Congress or doesn't go to Congress. You tweeted this week about, quote, Bob Mueller and his gang of Democrat thugs. Right. If Whitaker decides in any way to limit or curtail the Mueller investigation, are you okay with that? Look, he, it's going to be up to him. Uh, I think he's very well aware politically. I think he's astute politically. He's a very smart person, uh, a very respected person. He's going to do what's right. I really believe he's going to do what's right. But you won't overrule him if he decides to curtail. I would not get involved. And all these people that say, I'm going to end the investigation, you know, they've been saying that now for how long has this witch hunt gone on? It's gone on for what? Since May of 17. Okay, but how long have I been looked at? You know when I've been looked at? Since from the July day of I 2016. From the day I announced, I was looked at as a candidate with nothing, no proof, with phony people like McCabe and Strook and his lover. You had uh, Lisa Page, his lover. These people were looking at me. They wanted an insurance policy just in case I won or Hillary lost. And this was the insurance policy. It's a scam. There was no collusion whatsoever. And the whole thing is a 